Next question is from S. Miller, UK24. Is there any science that proves old man strength is really a thing? Ah, uh, cool question. Yeah, yeah it, it is a real thing. Yeah, so we've all it, seen it. Any, yeah, any teenage boy who's ever wrestled with his dad or, or his uncle uh, will attest. It's like I remember, Dude, my, even my grandpa. Man, I got a grip on him. I remember this as a kid. It's like you know, I'm 17. You're starting to feel like you're all you know, full of yourself. Yeah. Testosterone's at all time highs, and you know, I'm lifting weights already. You know, and and I know I can outlift my uncle or whatever, and. Then we start wrestling, and I'm like, holy cow, Like, where does this strength come from? I know I could lift more than you. Mm -hmm. I know I could beat you in arm wrestling. But then when we tussle, it's like you're, you're kicking my ass. Or you go do some you know, some, some blue-collar work with one of your older male relatives, and they just put you to shame. There's something that we don't consider when, it, when, when we're thinking about strength oftentimes. Strength, definitely, there's a, a big component of it. It's your muscles, how, how big they are and how, much, how hard they can contract. That's true. But a lot of strength is also skill. A lot of strength yes. is skill. What I mean by skill is you have a there's a learned way that you can apply force that makes it uh, generate more force. The yeah. most effective, most efficient way of doing very specific movements and very specific tasks, which uh, over time, think about how long they've lived in that body and how uh, long they've known how to move very specific ways without losing energy, without, you know, fatiguing, but, you know, being real comfortable with the way that they're applying this force uh, towards you. It's like totally. they're masters of it. CNS. I mean, yep. they, this is they've they've invested you know sixty years of their life into their amplifier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know they may have been off. Maybe maybe they spent a little time buying speakers or upgrading that. This, but at the end of the day, they have they are so in tune with their body and connected because they've got so many years on you that that they are so efficient at whatever it is that they do. And then if you add in that they were physical at all. Maybe they had they were contractors and they had to mm -hmm. grip and do things like that, or they did have bouts in their life where they lifted weights for five years consistently, then fell off for ten years and lifted again for two years. I mean, you got to add all that up. Yeah, all that up. They're they are they're putting money in the CNS bank every time they were doing things like that, and they've just got so many more years on you. And uh, I remember that, um, that this never made sense to me, right? I remember being like a twenty five year old kid who'd already had at this point, you know, a good amount of years of lifting weights consistently. And like my dad didn't lift at all, but then we would wrestle around and he could still grab me, hold me and pin me down. And it <laughs> yeah. would piss me off because I'm just like, I don't understand. This doesn't make sense to me why he can do that. And no, this is, there's definitely yeah. science to support that. If you've ever, if you've ever seen uh, like a big dog breed and you've seen, and if you've ever raised a big dog breed, you know that they grow real fast at first and, and they reach almost full size quite early but they're clumsy but they're goofy and they're yeah. goofy they don't really know because they're not used to their bodies you know what i mean they don't know how to move very well. this is what happens uh, to, to us too like right now if you were to take me okay now I'm, I'm you know 40 and i've been in my body for a while and you just added two inches of height to my body i would be taller and bigger but i would lose some of my 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 strength skill i'm not used to this new body that I have. It's two inches bigger than I've been, you know, for the longest time, right? So these older men, they've been in their body for so long, they're very used to the body. When you're a young guy, you just got big. So you're going to need some years to get used. You're that clumsy puppy. You're that clumsy big dog. And yeah, you got the size, but you're moving all over the place and you don't know how to, how to use it. And the old guy's going to wipe the floor with you. Oh, yeah.